Hi everyone, this is Amir from Stockholm Micro Soldering and Board Repair again. In this video I'm gonna share with you how to fix a problem of a RAM B-Pen on a MacBook Pro. Uh, we have seen many people trying to change or to upgrade their RAM from 4GB to 8GB or from 8GB to 16GB and they encounter this problem that the, the computer either doesn't start or doesn't show an image or it starts beeping. Now I have uh, a MacBook Pro uh, from the middle of 2012 15-inch Core i7 uh, running the latest version. The client, this uh, MacBook was sent to me by someone who claims that uh, his MacBook became really slow and he tried to upgrade it from uh, High Sierra which is 10.13 to Catalina which is 10.15 but it didn't really solve the problem. So he wants to uh, upgrade his RAM to make the computer faster so he bought, uh, let me see here, he sent paper that says um, my computer beeps uh, after trying to upgrade the RAM uh, from 8 gigabyte to 16 gigabyte and he even bought a new RAM which is SDD uh, sorry DDR3L 8 gigabytes 1600 MHz with 338 crown which is equivalent to 33 dollar so uh, the client he tried to upgrade his RAM and he found out that the bottom RAM slot is not reading the RAM which results in the computer uh, beeping. So let's proceed uh, uh, in fixing this uh, MacBook, fixing this beeping problem and if you have a similar problem please watch this video because I'm going to show you all the steps and all the solutions to fix this problem. Let's get it done. So the first thing we're going to start with is to um, remove the back cover of the, the MacBook Pro. Uh, let me see where is my screwdriver. You're not going to need too much um, many screwdrivers except um, the star ones. Uh, you're gonna start by removing these screws from here. I have already removed them, so you remove the back side like this. They're like uh, 2, 4, um, 8, and 10 screw drives. Uh, screws that you're gonna really need to remove. You remove the back side, and I have the, I have a RAM on the bottom uh, RAM slot. So now what I'm gonna do is that I am gonna do like this. I'm gonna start my uh, MacBook like this and again I'm gonna see if it uh, beeps because I have already fixed the problem so for the sake of the video I'm gonna do it again and see if it beeps. One, two, three, I have started the computer now. Now as you see it beeps three times. Let's hear the beep one more time. Three times. In this case you're gonna uh, disconnect the computer from the battery like this and make sure that you're not using any metal tank while the computer is on. So, uh, as you have seen the computer is beeping, three beeps. Uh, I have tried uh, many solutions, I have removed the board, I have inspected the RAM slot if they are like soldered uh, correctly to the board with the microscope and I saw that everything looks fine. Uh, what I tried to do because there was part of the job the client had an um, HDD core disk with 500 gigabyte and I advised him to change to uh, an SSD hard drive which is faster. When I did this the computer was faster and I made uh, a fresh installation for 
um, an operative system which is high Sierra. I put high Sierra with another SSD hard drive and it was only 8 gigabyte in one RAM slot working and the computer was enough fast so I know that the, the, the client is gonna be useful. So uh, the first solution, the first solution is that that you need to release these screws here you release them or you remove them completely uh, I have tried this solution it didn't work for me to be honest but it could be uh, one of the solution that works for you you release them all until you get them out and you put them again so you have like one two three four screws that you remove all and you put them again and when you put them try to make sure that you're not tightening them. If this solution doesn't work with you you will find a sticker here this sticker that goes here this sticker might sometimes probably uh, make a problem with this glue making these uh, uh, these uh, lines here are making connection somehow uh, it's not really actual with all the MacBook but try to uh, 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 try this solution uh, in case it works for you for me it didn't work so I tried with different ROMs from different uh, uh, manufacturer like Samsung, OMC, uh, Mac memory uh, Hynix and many other and all they were compatible to what Apple says while upgrading a MacBook from the middle of 2012 15 inch Core 7 so I got the right reference for this RAM but still I got the beep I changed the operative system as I told you still I got the same beep now I discovered my problem was here so you remove uh, your RAM from the bottom uh, uh, of the slot, of the bottom RAM slot, and you're gonna need a card like this, any card that's gonna be not so thicker, and you're gonna need, let me see, uh, a scissor, yes you're gonna need a scissor to cut this uh, ROM, this card, sorry, on this uh, shape. So the first thing you start with is that you put this card, this piece of card, under the ROM slot like this and uh, make sure that you have the same size so it doesn't go over the board or it doesn't uh, make obstacle for the RAM so that you lift uh, the RAM slot reader a little bit because it might be a problem with uh, the solder of the RAM slot to the board and in this case there are like many uh, uh, how you call them many uh, dots or many legs that are soldered to the board and you cannot get there and solder them. Uh, if you have a problem with the soldering, it's kind of a, a real problem. It's not uh, oh, it's not something that you can do easily. Anyway, after we have done this, you have put this piece of paper under the sim, uh, under the the ROM slot reader. You try to put another one under it, like this. Try to lift the first one, so the second one go under it, like this. And try to keep the first one, so you can push the, the one under a little bit inside. So, as you see here, I have two uh, piece of papers that are kind of oh, 
not so thick and all. It's not a paper, but it should be a card. A card will work. Um, after we have done this, then I'm gonna put my 8 gigabyte on um, the RAM slot, the bottom one that didn't work first here. I'm gonna see if it's sitting correctly then I'm gonna put the next one actually I had the problem only with the first one with the bottom uh, RAM slot that didn't work this one it, that was the one that gave me, gave me the beep but now after I have fixed the problem I'm gonna put 16 gigabyte I'm gonna put 8 gigabyte plus 8 gigabyte it's gonna be 16 gigabyte so I'm gonna put the second ROM like this and I'm gonna put my battery back gonna lift my computer my Mac as I told you I changed the hard drive from the whole DD to SSD and now let's uh, test our computer here is the moment of truth here we go I click power C you hear that the Mac is starting straight it's starting one more time because it's detecting the RAM because first it didn't have a RAM it's kind of starting really fast because it was taking forever just be patient now we didn't get the beep we have just solved the beep of a MacBook Pro in the middle of 2012 just as easy with a piece of paper I was taking the board out let me put my password one two three four because this is a new operative system it's just for a try and here we go so let's do like this let's put my MacBook back Put the back cover and let me show you here how many gigabytes we have on the RAM. Okay, here we go. So uh, let's do like this. Let's go to Mac about this Mac this computer is in Swedish let's put RAM and as you see we have 16 gigabytes RAM we have 16 gigabytes RAM on this computer and we have solved our client problem I got a really happy client here anyway please if you have the same problem try this solution to remove the streaker first try to remove sticker second try to uh, release these screws completely and then put them back and try with another RAM and check if your RAM is not damaged uh, like here sometimes you see that the, the, some RAMs they are like damaged here and you you can also try cleaning your RAM slot by some alcohol by putting some alcohol here and while the computer is off try to put it in and out in and out to clean this these pins but honestly all these solutions didn't work with me because um, it took some time to discover what was the problem so I did use at the end that the problem is in one of the parts which is not soldered to the board correctly in this case uh, if you have one of the parts which is not soldered to the board correctly there is not so much that you can do about it because it's very difficult to solder the parts to the board again because you cannot reach them as I said earlier uh, this is how you fix most of the MacBook that has this particular problem uh, while upgrading your RAM and it starts beeping for all kind of MacBook or iMac except for the MacBook Air because it comes with integrated 
um, an upgradable uh, RAM, which is like small chips soldered to um, to the board. For such a uh, solution, you can watch one of uh, Louis Rosman video about how to make a reflow. Uh, Louis Rosman is a uh, very expert. I have good respect for that guy, uh, as he defends the right to repair the independent repairer. Um, we are like following you, Rosman, and we like you so much. Um, so. Uh, it doesn't matter what kind of MacBook you have. Try this solution. Remove the sticker. Release the uh, the screws and change your RAM. Check that the RAM is fine and there is no damage on uh, this tiny pins here. And if it doesn't work, so try this last solution, which is to put uh, a piece of paper that's gonna lift the RAM uh, slot reader and makes connection. Thank you for watching this video. If you see that it's useful, please subscribe for my channel for more videos.